Hi guys, Ian and Blake from the Football Boots team and today we're going to have a look inside this massive box. I can't even count how many pairs of boots we've got in there. Should we have a look? Too many boots. Alright, so here wow. we go. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, at least eight pairs of boots in here I reckon. So Where do we start? You want to start with some Adidas? Maybe there's yeah, Nike over give here. You, you start the, you decide. This one, I've got my hand on this one. We'll have a little look. Let's do it. Alright, so we've got Adidas box here. Blake, what, what is in the box? Well, we've got a bag. I've got a brag with a so big the clue there. X on X. the front. We what have are these. What are these? The Spectral Mode X18 Plus. What do you think of this? Um, I quite like the white. I think maybe we might get a chance to see a few other um, Spectral Mode boots. One thing that I'm noticing on the Spectral Mode is this little gold tinge might be a little bit of a thing that actually is consistent through yes. some of the boots. I can definitely I've only see just that. noticed right now. Yes. But so, X18s, think about these and compare them to something like this. Yes. Quite a difference in colour. Yes. These are going to get real grassy green, like yellow sort of, around the edges, around the, like the World Cup boots did. Yeah, I mean, like, like all the World Cup boots like that, it's just going to get really sort of... But that's what happens with white boots, it's definitely a clean boot. What type of players are wearing these? Obviously, um, we've seen players on the um, Premier League pictures wearing these. Yeah, like Mo Salah is the biggest player, probably going to wear these. We've also got Gabriel Jesus. Lots of players actually wear the X18 Plus. Yeah, and it, it looks very similar to the 18.1s in this drop. Yeah, I I, I don't I personally don't like white out boots, but I can appreciate it. I quite like the um the soft liner in these actually. They're talking about that gold. Yeah, you can just see that they're in a nice yeah gold exactly unleashed yeah, speed nice. with these. But Blake, I think we're going to have a full review of these up on the um, YouTube exactly, channel coming yes. very soon. So very we'll talk soon. more about those. Let's move on to another pair of boots in this box. Where should we go next? Ooh, Maybe uh, another handle? Yeah, let's do, let's do it. All right. Oh, I can see what it is already. That has Nemesis on the boot bag. So boot bag with these again. It means we're talking the plus model. Okay. Slightly different color wise. Spectrum mode Nemesis 18 plus. Grayed out. What do, you, what do you think about the gray on those? A little subdued almost. Very subdued. I mean, I personally don't like them. I, I think they're more of a trainer collection than a, a boot pack, but what do you think of these? I don't like the gray necessarily. I think it's a bit of a meh colorway. I don't think places are actually stocking very many of these. I think those uh, blue ones are a lot more popular if you're going to go with the Nemesis. Oh yeah, for like sure. This, or even the Messi versions. Messi has his own version of these um, Spectral Modes as well. Like players, who's wearing these on pitch player-wise? Not many. Bernardo Silva and Roberto Firmino. Literally the only two biggest players. Again, I think this is the colorway I personally don't like, but I can see people liking this. Guys, let us know in the comments below what you are thinking about these boots and we're going to move on to perhaps some more in this box and see what else we've got. Yep. Get those out of the way. I'm interested right, to see. Do you want to go Nike? I, I, I'm, I'm curious you to see, see what's, what's in this, this one. Yeah, All right, that? okay. Well, I can tell you guys that just for a little bit of excitement, we put a bit of paint on the end of the box. Wow, okay. Because it ties in with these. Grab those out of the bag. Okay, so you can see Predator on the string bag there. Excited to see this. Wow. Oh my God, okay. Look at those. So there's that sock line again. Real pastely pink. Yes. Gold tinge on there again. So obviously the pink predators. Very, very unique colorway. I think unique describes it good. Definitely. Now shout out to the guys at Ultra Football for sending us this massive box of boots. Yeah. We've still sure. got at least four more pairs to go. Yeah. Um, if you want to get yourself 10% off any of these current boots, then head over to ultrafootball.com and use the 10% discount code FBUK10. Save yourself a bit of money. Blake, what do you think of these? I am a little bit um, surprised by them because I thought they were just this kind of plain pink all over, but looking yes. them up close. But like as you can see in that light there, it's got that sort of goldy orange tinge to it. Yes. And even the knit has this little kind of extra little bit of design um, kind of going on with it that I wasn't expecting. Yes. So it's quite nice in the upper. Players on pitch, who's wearing these? Uh, Paul Pogba, Dali Ali, Rakitic, and Mesut Ozil. So it's all about matching up with that Man United kit, I suppose. Of course. I mean, and that's this whole pack, I suppose. The Adidas yeah. stuff is all matching with kits and stuff. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think these are quite nice. Guys, maybe give us a rating out of five on these. Yep. Uh, hit the poll card now. Let us know what you think. Stop. Blake, what do you think? Five out of five for these. Bearing oh. in mind colorway as well. Personal opinion, I'm gonna give it a one. Whoa! I you, don't. I don't, I don't like think this. I've ever heard you be so harsh about a boot. Well, I never give a one for a boot, but this one I would. All right, you're gonna give those a one. It's all right. All right. So let's get all those Adidas stuff out of the way. Um, we've got another pair of Adidas there. Should we do those before we? No, let's do the Nike now. Yeah, let's do Nike. All right. Crap, one Nike. Open. Guys, you are gonna be excited to see what's in this box. I'm excited. Wow. Okay. Let's see. It. That's a hint. Any clues? Any clues? 
Lovely so, bag. Seven logos for his seven chapters. All right, test it. Name the chapters. Uh, Savage Beauty, Natural Diamonds, Whoop, sorry, Discovery, Forge for Greatness, Cut to Brilliance, Spawn Leader, and what's the what's the last Built one? Built on Dreams. Built there on we dreams. go. Have a hold of that. Wow. Look at that. It just pops, doesn't it? It pops very nicely. Now we can see a lot of sevens around the forefoot here because this is his last chapter, and obviously CR seven. Got this the seven on the hill there. You got his um, signature as well. These are so nice in hand. The color of these as well, very nice. It's quite a poppy red. It's very, very poppy red. It's, it's almost like a crimson. It's like a it's sort of like a World Cup tied tied into the um, studs here on the heel and the front. Um, and this carbon fiber esque yes. look that yes. Ronaldo really likes. Um, oh man, I wish that was carbon fiber. How good would that be? I actually, I'm going to say this. I think this has to be up there as my, one of my favorite chapters for CR7. Once you get it in hand, you can see this boot is absolutely quality. Yes. Um, real nice details with that carbon fiber on the swoosh as well. Yes. I think Nike have done really well with this. You see maybe images before they come out and you're not so sure. But when you see that, if you got 250 quid, which boot are you gonna buy? <laughs> that's, a great, that's a great example. Vote, vote in the poll card now. Would yes. you buy the CR7s or would you buy the Predators? <laughs> I think I know the answers. I'm wondering whether we can get over 90% of the people voting for CR7s. I think it's going to be higher than that. You think it's going to be even higher than that? Yeah. Um, nice little detail you can quite see on the um, sock liner yes. is it matches the bag that we had um, as well. Yes, so, so it has all the chapter details. But yeah, overall, a cracking boot. It'd be interesting to know if any of you guys are going to buy these, maybe in the scaled down versions of the academies, yeah. um, the pros. You can also get the low version as well. Yeah. Um, very nice boot indeed. I can't wait to... Um, have a little bit more of a look at these. I think they're fantastic. No, stunning, absolutely well stunning. Well done, Nike. All right, guys, we've got some more boxes to get into. So, Blake, should we head back to the Adidas and wrap that up before we get into what is in these three Nike boots? I am um, excited to see what's in that, but let's we'll to the Adidas. All right, let's have a look in here. Different now, box. Now, talking about matching the kits, obviously we're on the Spectral mode still. These are wow. the coppers. Okay, so copper 18.1. Potentially the, the last mode. copper 18. Yes, yes, and Maybe a good thing, time a, to move on. A very trainer-esque colorway, mint. Yeah, I mean, no players wear these, do they? Anybody wearing them? Um, I don't think anyone wears Not them. So we can think of, guys, if you can think of somebody, let us know in the comments below, exactly. please do. Yeah, tell us. Um, this one's designed to match with what, the buy-in kit? The buy-in away kit, which is that minty sort of color, so. Look good with what Bournemouth used to have, or do they have like a Bournemouth, minty kit? Like Bournemouth, Arsenal maybe last had like season. a minty kit as well, didn't they? Arsenal have one this season, yes. A lot of minty kits floating around. Yeah, but um, again, gold details. Gold details throughout this pack. Yes, on the on the tongue there and on the sock liner. And All right, marks out of five for these. I actually don't hate these. I think I'm gonna give it a modest three. Three. All right, guys, yes. let's move on. Should we go on to the next box that we got? Yes, let's do it. All right, so we're gonna have a look in this one. Now, this one's interesting because in the top is a shirt from the guys from Ultra Football. And um, they sent this over to us. This is from their Phantom Vision event that they had in Melbourne, where they had right. a massive pyramid and an indoor futsal tournament and stuff. And as I said, if you want to get any of the boots in this video, then head over to Ultra Football and you can get 10% off using that discount code FBUK10. Solid but deal, solid deal. Look, in here, we've got something okay. a bit different, right? What are they, Blake? Okay, it's a Phantom Vision, but what version is it? Guys, you know, can you tell straight away? The clue is in the lace cover, right? And I'm gonna grab the um, elite version. Okay. And now you can see the difference between the two. So I'm comparing what is the academy version yes. to the elite version. So this is way cheaper. The difference is, is you're not getting ACC, you're getting a different upper. Yep. Ghost laces is just covered by this kind of like neoprene type cover almost, neoprene, rather than yep. the knit and stuff. Sole plate's completely Sole plate, different. similar um, look. Same stud design, but yep. completely different materials. Not that high quality. But not a bad option if you want to save a bit of cash. Yeah, you half can get a pair of those. They're available at Ultra Football as well. Cool. All right, so we've got two more boxes. Let's have a look and see what are in these. Move those out of the way. Now this one was just this one was just a filler, so everything didn't rattle around in the box. All right. Um, okay, so we're looking in this one. Oh, okay. Now, if you guys are thinking, whoa, they're the World Cup Superflies. Well, they kind of are, but these are the World Cup Superflies. These are the Pro, so they're only one level down, and they're actually a really good option if you want to save a bit of cash, because as you can see, they look pretty yes. similar. Yes. Few little differences, obviously like the um, the Flyknit isn't 360. 
But especially like when you've got boots up that have been used at the World Cup, you can get these on discount for a very decent yeah, price. Yeah, for its price point, I think it's pretty good. And it's almost kind of similar going back to kind of old Superflies. This is kind of just years and generations ahead. Now, the other boot I wanted to look about, talking about going backwards, is the last box we have here. Now guys, please, before I open this last one, where is it here? Yep. Have a vote in the poll card now. I want you to tell us what your favorite boot is out of this entire box. Best boot out of the lot. You know my answer, I've already said it. All right. CL7. <laughs> we know. I reckon you guys are probably voting the same way too. Yes. All right, okay. Last pair Still in up. the box. Now these ones are really interesting because they are pro ones again. But I want to bring in these because they're very similar to these. Blake, what are these? So that is this is the Vapor 11, so a defunct boot now, but pretty much the same boot. Yes, so this this is more of that Tyson synthetic we saw in previous Yeah, papers. and a lot of players really like those. You even find some players who are actually wearing these pros in games, some goalies and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I mean, Little boot spots here and there. It's actually one of the best value value ranges on the market right now, the, the pro version of the Vapor, right? Yes. So now guys, as always, we've got competitions running on the website. So please make sure you like and share this video. The link is there now to do that. And um, that gives you the opportunity to perhaps win some boots with us. So head over to the website and enter the competition, share this box uh, unboxing with everybody you know, and we'll get you in the draw. We are drawing winners all the time. So please head over and do that. Blake, I think that about wraps up the video. Yeah, let's do it. Let's uh, close it. All right, okay guys, thanks very much for watching. Go enjoy your football.